What's up guys, I'm Crazy Jack. welcome to Structus, a neat little sci-fi game about which I know very little, so let's just go ahead and play. Uh, okay, well, the game already broke my computer. That's cool. What the hell? So these are buttons, I guess. Is my cursor showing? Okay, so. Um, so I can plague me or I can quit. I, I assume I want plague me. Polygamy isn't a good thing, but I assume that's what I want in this case. Also, why is my webcam so bright today? It's really bright-ish. Wait, what? Come on, dude. What are you talking about? I want the play. Wait, so I have to hit quit? I knew this was supposed to be sort of like a puzzle game, but... A puzzle doesn't just give you the opposite thing of what you want. That doesn't, that doesn't make sense. You don't just... Unless there is something that... Leads you to believe that might be the case. Oh, really? My mouse is just gonna flicker in the middle of the screen? Really? Is it just gonna... Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna turn off my cursor. One sec. Okay, so I can still see my cursor flickering, but now you guys can't. So that's that's beneficial for you guys. That's something they need to fix. Wow. Okay. Um. All right. So, interesting. This appears to be a deserted world of some kind. Alrighty. I can run. It's actually kind of cool. The run changes the focal field a little bit, which is kind of neat. It's a little it's subtle, but I like it. Why is there a tree going out the side? Because, <clears throat> like, when trees... It's actually really cool. When trees are planted on angles... I mean, this is a building, so it probably wouldn't even grow very well at all. But when trees are planted on angles, what they'll do is they'll grow like this. So they'll grow outward from the thing, and they'll grow up towards the sun. It's kind of cool, actually. So what is this supposed to be? There's a random thing on the wall. Just a random pattern. Okay. Random patterns are good with me. That one's green. I like the green one. So is there anything around here that I should actually be looking for in particular? Uh, I don't know. I think I should just kind of pick a direction. This one has yellow on it. I'm going to go for the yellow. Let's do the yellow thing. Yeah. My favy. Looks like it has text beside it. Top. Okay. There's a... There's a whoa, I can really jump. Either I'm on some other planet, or I am just like the athlete of the year. So, top. That's that's all you had for me, huh? Is that all you had? Whoa, I can jump so freaking high. Wow, that is awesome. Okay, um, let's see. I'm used by small things, okay? This is a normal thing. Uh, more up here? Any, any other additional hints? No? Okay, no additional hints here, so... We know that that weird four pentagon thing means top. That That is top, okay. Also, the music just changed and got a little weird. Were those dots there before? I feel like all those dots were not there before. Maybe I'm just crazy, but I feel like that is not the case. Up we go. I keep pressing E to jump because for some reason this feels a bit like oblivion. Interesting, so three red dot, three red triangles, okay. So we've got four yellow pentagons, top, and three red triangles, something else. And more trees growing sideways, neat. It's kind of funny, this world is kind of like barren and desolate, but at the same time it's also built on grass texture, so it's kind of... I'm trying to figure out exactly what this world is, if it's actually like a, a barren, desolate world, or whether it's thriving and just very sparsely populated. Also, this building appears to be floating. Maybe I'm crazy, but it appears to be floating. Ah, okay, I thought I wouldn't be able to go through that. Never mind. Eh, okay. So, I'm up here. Wait, I can't I can't go in? Wait, was I not supposed to be in there to begin with? Because it's... Oh, no, it's floating from the outside, too. Okay, I'm going back in. I want to figure out what this place has to offer me. Because I think I can go up if I find the... Whoa, jeez. I don't think I'm supposed to do that. If I find the right place to jump on, maybe I can get up to the top, which would be really cool. Uh, oink! Maybe I can make that. Maybe I can. No, I can't. There's no way. Ah. Okay. Plan B. Eh. Can I make that? No, I can't. Okay. We're going to do this, guys. I'm going to make it up. I'm going to make it to the top. I don't think I'm actually supposed to, but I kind of want to. And up. Oh. Maybe I can make that. Maybe I can't. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Ah, crap. That was not what I wanted. I can probably make it back over here, though. I keep overestimating my jump. Because I, I don't think there's fall damage or dying in this game, so... I don't really care if I jump from too high or, you know, a deathly height. It's also kind of funny. Hitting something on my head doesn't stop my jump. I just, like, I just, I just, I just keep jumping. I just continue jumping. 
while my head is being hit. That's that's kind of amusing. All right. Wee. So, am I supposed to be getting anything from up here? It said, like, the, the description page said it was a sci-fi puzzle something or other. There's a thing up there. There is a thing up there that I'm, that I kind of want to get. Like, it said it was a sci-fi puzzle-ish kind of game. And I was like, okay, that sounds interesting. But I'm not, I'm not seeing the puzzle. Except for the fact that play was quit and quit was play. I'm not actually seeing anything puzzling exactly. But I'm getting up higher and higher. That's cool. I also have no idea what that thing is, but... All right. Eh. Oh, no, no, don't, 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 don't fall. Don't fall, dude. Don't fall. No, we're good. We're good. We're okay. Stop. Dude, dude, just, just, ah! Controls are a little wonky. Okay, um, I was up higher, wasn't I? I think I was up there, wasn't I? Eh, jeez. I lost height. Can I land on this? Nope, I can't, but I probably can't jump through it either. Well, I can. Okay. But there is that up there. Um, where do I go now? Can I make that? No, not quite. Ah, get back to my level. Ah! Okay, um... Over here, maybe. Get something over here. I can land on this thing, maybe. And then... Okay, what now? See, I really don't think I'm supposed to be doing this. It definitely does not seem like something I'm supposed to be able to do. But at the same time, the design is so facilitative. Is that a word? I just made it a word. It's so facilitative of me doing this that it just, it just feels right, man. It just feels right. But I don't think I can make that jump. I'm officially at the top of the thing, and I have an awesome view. This is really an awesome view. I like it. Ooh, pretty. Mmm. Thumbnail posing. Mmm. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um. I don't think I can get up there. I don't think I can jump that high. No, I can only jump about half that high. Well, that's unfortunate. But there's only one answer, I guess. I, I guess the only answer now is suicide. So I'm gonna jump off this building. Full damage. Here I come. Oh no, my life is flashing before my eyes! I see, I see school, and, and, and university, and oh my god, I, all I spent my life doing was learning. Um, so what is this? Can I, can I get through that? I can't! Why do they only let me through one way? I can only get out through them. That's unfortunate. I also have not found the puzzles yet. I kind of hope there'd be one at the top of that thing, where I could go up and get the, the green thing by solving a puzzle. But apparently not so much. There's a thing out there. I'm going for that thing. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing at this point. It's time to turn into an exploration game like, um... Uh, what was that one game? Was it called Leron? I think it was one of the exploration games. Dream was kind of exploratory, but it had puzzles. It was more like a puzzle game. Um, I'm trying to think of what I was... I know I've played other kind of intro... Or, you know, just like... Calm games that don't really mean anything. Um, I just had another one in mind. Uh, Mountain was kind of like that. And there's still others that I know I'm missing. I know there's definitely others that I've played. Um, there was the one where there was supposed to be a fox. I think it was called, like, Sean the Fox or something like that. And there was no fox in it. Um, I, I've played a few of these games. And honestly, I kind of enjoy them. It's just that I came into this one with the, 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 the um, predisposition that I would be solving puzzles. So that's kind of what I'd hope for. There's a tree growing upside down. That just, that just literally does not happen. That is just not a thing that we can do. Eh, come on. Oh, I guess I can't get up there. But I can go down. Anything down here? I really don't know if there's actually anything to find here. Considering it, it feels like the game lied to me about being a puzzle game, which I'm not too happy about. But it, it honestly feels like there isn't anything to find. Okay, dude, I need you to stop jumping. Okay, um... Well, I think I'm stuck now, except I can probably get out through that green thing at the end. But I just don't know. I, 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 I can't think of anything else to actually do. I've been to like three of the various locations. And aside from that green thing that I couldn't reach, I, I can't really think of anything I've found that is different or, you know, peculiar that I feel like I need to be moving towards. I see all these dots and they are moving a direction. So maybe I should follow them. They appear to be moving out this way. And I thought before they were moving to that giant tower, and that's kind of why I went to it. I was like, hey, it looks like the dots are moving towards it. The dots just disappeared. More dots moving this way? Still still moving this way? Okay, good. We're still moving this way. So we'll go check this thing out and see if it's actually a thing that is important. More sideways trees because of logic. What is that? Is that? Hang on. Oh, it's just a hole in the wall. Never mind. It looked like a thing. Never mind. So is this not a thing either? It's just, it's just a shiny. 
I mean, I like shiny things, but it's just it's just a shiny. It's just I it's just a shiny. That that's all it is. And there's a blue shiny, which is not See, here's another one. Shifter. And those are the, the same red triangles I found before. They didn't have a label beside them, I think. So I found top and shifter and I I don't know. See, part of the problem here, I'm going to keep looking around while I kind of explain why I'm a little lost as to what I'm supposed to do. The game didn't give me anything to work towards. See, usually, like, in any kind of game where there's puzzles, whether it's, like, Silent Hill, or whether it's Dream, or whether it's, like, a puzzle platformer, or anything like that, there's usually a goal. They set you forward with a specific goal in mind, or at least a next destination, so you have something to work towards. And then you find puzzles along the way, and you solve them. A-OK. -okay. That's exactly how a puzzle game should work. This game seems to ditch that goal thing entirely. And it's basically like, okay, here is a puzzle, solve it. It doesn't get you anything. You don't get any hints as to what the puzzle might even be, but there's there's things out there, there's a puzzle, go solve it. And at least to me, maybe I'm in the minority here, but to me that's not how a puzzle game should work. Like I said, there should be a goal, there should be a focus. It should be saying, get off this barren planet. You need to find the you know pieces of your ship, like Pikmin. Find the pieces of your ship and get off the planet. Hey, I found a thing! Uh, something like that, that kind of guides you and then say, you know, the, the parts of the ship are scattered in the various ruins. And go find them and then put a piece of the ship in each of the ruins and you go solve a puzzle at each one. Okay, so I got blue dots. Good, I guess. Wait, now there's a red thing over with the red stuff. But it looks like it's behind that red fence that I couldn't get through before. Because this wasn't here before. It most definitely was not. But how do I get through there? What? 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 Did I do something wrong? Did I do something in the wrong order? I don't know. Is the blue thing back here now? Yeah, blue thing's back. So, is there like a specific order to do it? So I got... Circles. Okay. Wait, it comes back. What the hell? What? So I do that, and then it comes back after a certain amount of time. And when I tried to collect the red one, it just made my screen go all weird. I don't know. I don't get it. Why did the blue thing make the... Okay, so I guess each one is making shapes up here because the, the triangles aren't here actually right now either. There, so the, that makes the triangles up here. So each of these little diamond things that I'm collecting makes a shape up here. Blue circles, uh, red triangles, and I'm assuming yellow pentagons because I've seen those. Um, also, my mouse is still flickering in the center of the screen. Just, just so you guys know. Just thought I'd share that with you guys. So we'll see if over here there's a yellow diamond that I can pick up. I don't know, I feel like I'm talking about Steven Universe at this point. See, there's blue dots that has a word beside it. So I now have three words. Find. So I've got blue circles find, red triangles shifter, yellow pentagons top. So find top shifter? I, I just, I don't know. And there is yellow dot here, but, or yellow light here, but... I don't see any yellow thing to pick up. I just, I don't know. And it's kind of like, am I missing something at this point? Am I supposed to just wander and hope I find stuff? And I don't, I don't really get it. And honestly, the big ruins haven't led me to anything yet. I haven't really gotten anything from being in any of these larger ruins. It's all the small ones that have had useful stuff. Useful stuff. I haven't, like I said, I still haven't figured out what the puzzle is. I think find top shifter is maybe my hint. That's maybe what is supposed to help me solve whatever puzzle they have in mind here. But what is a shifter? Where is the top shifter? How do I find it? Is it the green thing that I found at the very beginning and couldn't get to? Also, I didn't even press space there. It just jumped for me. Uh, there's a purple thing back here. I found purple. Yoink. Okay, purple hexagons. Neato! What do purple hexagons mean? Do I get a word for those? Or is that is that a negatory on that one? That's gonna be a negative, isn't it? Okay. 
I get no word for purple hexagons, apparently. Unless it's on the outside. Maybe. I don't know. I'm really guessing at this point. I'm really kind of reaching. No, I don't know. I don't see it. I mean, there's a couple more places I haven't been to yet, so... Let's fast forward into the future and go to those places, I guess. Okay, we're here. All right, um... I'm looking for some purple hexagons. Do you have any purple hexagons for me? Do you, do you have any purple hexagons for me? You don't have any purple hexagons for me, do you? That's gonna be a negatory on that one. I don't think I'm gonna get any purple hexagons from that one. Okay. Well, next, I guess. All right, we're at this one now. Looks like you guys maybe have some more stuff for me here. There's, okay. Oh, I got a yellow thing on the wall. Dimensional. Find top dimensional shifter? I don't know. I think, I think what it's trying to do, I think everything it's trying to work me towards is getting to the top of that thing and getting that green thing. I think that's what the whole goal of this thing is. I'm pretty sure that is the top dimensional shifter they're referring to here. I think that's what the whole point of the game is. But how am I supposed to get to it? I don't know. I don't have anything that would let me get to that. Did I go into this thing? I don't know if I went into this part of the thing. I don't think I did. I'm like, I'm really trying to figure out what this puzzle is, but I just, it's just not telling me anything except find top dimensional shifter. And that might not even be the sentence. It might be find shifter dimensional top. Maybe this is like Beyblade and I'm supposed to be looking for a top. Also, I'm, I'm not holding jump anymore. You can stop. Apparently not. Apparently it's just gonna keep jumping me. That's, okay, there we go. If you hit the jump button while you're jumping, it jumps you again. So if you if you hold the space bar too long to jump, you'll just keep jumping. I gotcha, okay. Alrighty. And what about this? Is, there's nothing here, is there? There's absolutely nothing at this one. Th this was just completely pointless. All right, time to head to the vla- I think there's only one more. I think there's a house on the other side of this giant thing that there might be some stuff at. So let's go take a look. Wait, is, I thought there was a, there was, there's a house out here somewhere. I think, is that it right there? I think that's it right there. I'm trying to kind of see, I think, I, yeah, I think that's it there. I think maybe it might just be the skybox being weird. No, that's it. That is it. Cool. I knew there was one out here somewhere. I'd seen it from the other ones, but yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. I just like, I'm trying to do well at this game, but it just doesn't make any sense. It doesn't, it's not telling me anything. It, I, I just, I don't know. And if there's nothing in this place, I quit. Cause like there's one more over there, but I'm just running in circles looking for random stuff that I don't even know. I don't know what the, cert, the shapes mean. I don't know what the words mean. I don't know what the colors mean. I don't know if there's an order to this. It just, it doesn't make sense. And like, They've made a really kind of cool world here. I feel like the world design for this is actually very neat, except for the distance between the objects. But, like, the, the world design is very cool, but the game just doesn't, it doesn't do anything. And this is another thing that has absolutely nothing to do with anything. And it's just like, ah, I'm done. I'm, I, just, I just don't want to walk between these relics anymore. They're just, it's too far. I don't feel like I'm learning anything. All I know is shapes appear when I pick up diamonds, and those shapes sometimes have words with them. Find top dimensional shifter is best I could get from this. And the only thing I can think is it's in the top of that thing, but I tried to get up there and I couldn't. So I don't know. I think that's all I got. I don't think I have anything else I can do in this game. Maybe if I kept looking around, I could, but honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I just don't want to. The game isn't giving me any incentive to want to move on. So there's that. But anyway, if you guys want to try it out for yourself and see if you can solve the mystery of Structus, be my guest. The link in the description down below. But other than that, that's all I got. So thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you later.